Traveling in disguise. No, that's all right. I'm, uh, you're, uh, you're going on a visit. No, I'm wrong. That's, uh, by the way. You're, uh, you're running away. How did you guess? Ha, <laughs> ha. Professor Marvel never guesses. He knows. <laughs> some in this auditorium. There may be some here today that will be homosexual in the future. There are a lot of kids here. We don't know. But it's serious. Don't kid yourselves about it. They can be anywhere. They can be judges, lawyers. We ought to know we've arrested all of them. Because one out of three of you will turn queer. Tragic day for the gay and lesbian community in Uganda. They've already felt under fire. And certainly, though we do not know the motivation for this murder yet, there is certainly fingers will be pointed to the atmosphere that has been created by uh, both the government and just ordinary Ugandans. This homophobic atmosphere that is very palpable. Zuriel Roush is accused of having unprotected sex with men and not telling them he has HIV. Police fear there are as many as 70 people who have been unknowingly infected. 